Uh, we're here today in the South Island laying a fibre the cable for Spark. This project is part of Spark's replenishing programme to upgrade the West Coast fibre. It's 35 kilometres long. Oh, uh, things on bridge fixing. This is the easiest way for us to get across bridges. So we've got our high ab and our man cage and we're drilling in brackets into the side of the bridge to attach a galvanised pipe. Uh, my name's Andy McGowan, I'm the field manager here for Connectate. Uh, my job is the day-to-day -day running of the teams or the lads out on site. Yeah, this project is a complex project. Uh, we're drawing on all our resources and experience to try and achieve our milestones. So the advantages we have is we've got a, a wide variety of plant, tools, equipment and personnel and we can offer the client basically everything and anything to get this job done. So this is our mole plough, obviously it's pre-ripping at the moment, getting ready to put the product in the ground. We use a mole plough in rural areas where there's not a lot of services in the ground. So the advantage of using the plough is the fact that it's a lot quicker, it's clean, efficient, and it works very, very well with minimal impact on the environment. They pick their plough line, and then they do a thing called pre-ripping, which just moves all the rocks and everything out of the way. And then they come back and they put on their plough blade and lay the product through that, and they drag it down the ripping line which they've already pre-ripped and then they have a tidy up digger that comes through and basically patches up the ground afterwards. I think what sets Connect Aid apart from its competitors is our drive for operational excellence. We want to get things right first time. Rework is costly, so all our focus is on getting it right first time. We see that we can create efficiencies and we want to share them efficiencies with our customers. We've been drilling for about eight hours plus. Our ground. Our ground. So all we gotta do is replace the drill head to pull the duck back. As you can see, we've got two ducks here for the fibre. It's efficient. Uh, we can basically put the drill head anywhere we'd like. We can go under roads, go under railway crossings without having to set up roadworks for weeks on end. So we don't have to trench the roads and hold up the traffic. So we're just drilling through uh, the middle of the reef and this is our 2440, or my one that I'm operating at the moment. I'm just prepping my entry point. The straighter the drill is, the more push power will be for your drill. So in the hard ground you need it to be as much as possible. So uh, Roy is a locator and he gives me the direction and I just steer the drill and push it in which way the locator wants it to go. Yeah, pretty tight too. In the past 18 months we've grown the company considerably, we've invested heavily in equipment, but we see our true investment is in our people. All our emphasis at the moment is trying to create operational excellence from exceptional people. Connecta is a good company to work for. They always have given me the opportunity to grow myself, to always keep learning and become whatever I want to be. This talks to, to my drill rod that's telling me exactly where the drill head is and in which direction it's going. I get my three meters to three meters, drill for those three meters, then move on to the next three meters. Our advantage in the future is that we can have people who are knowledgeable about all aspects of the business. They understand where efficiencies can be gained. We're hooking up a 32 mil duck to this uh, special machine here. It's called a tornado. So we use a tornado to blow the fibre through the ducts. We put a sponge to clean the duct out because the last thing we want to do is damage this precious stuff. Send it through. Got the sponge. Good. Okay, so we're at the end of the job. We're just waiting for the last bit of fibre to come through to joint it, and then we're done. I'm Felix. I'm now doing the fibre jointing. You need to be very precise of cutting the fiber and you need to clean it as much as possible. One piece of fiber is just like a human hair. Put it in. I put it inside the fusion machine. So I'm done. This is the splice protection slip to protect the fiber. There is a 48 fiber, 12 fiber on each tube. I need to join it one by one. My name's John Berry, I'm the General Manager for Mobile for Connect8. So the mobile team was, was established at Connect8 to provide technical installation services for the mobile operators throughout New Zealand. Just getting the rope ready for our climb today. So today we'll be installing a new antenna up the tower. 
Uh, yeah, we're doing yeah, a lot of these grades, um, adding 700, which is um, another layer of 4G. So customers in their house can connect to broadband through the cell phone tower. So this here is the RRU that goes up the tower. This is what does all the magic. The key differentiator for the Connect 8 mobile group is that we've been able to start from fresh, pull together a team of experts from throughout New Zealand to create the centre of excellence. This is the hard part. So the opportunities for the mobile group's growth are enormous. We're seeing mobile networks throughout New Zealand expanded exponentially. We're seeing enormous growth in database services. So this is our smart aligner GPS tool. It connects to the GPS and then align the antenna to the correct azimuth. Yep, sweet, lock it off there. So we're testing the return loss on the antenna. Yep, all sweet, Sean. Everything's passing its test. Uh, now it's just pack up and move on to the next one. This group has the right people, it's got the right processes and the best technology to take advantage of this growth now and into the future. At the end of the day, Connect8 wants to create strong personal relationships with all of our customers. We see the customers' goals and strategies as our goals and strategies and we want to work together to deliver true value to the customer.